When I listen to this particular record, it's uh, a little uh, different than my other records because we had such a good time doing it. I forgot that actually it was a recording day. You know, it was so good to see everybody in New York City after such a long, grueling tour. For the past uh, few years, I've uh, often tried to get uh, the various record companies that I've been signed with to record me at a very high performance level after working, you know, continuously, continuously for. Uh, six to seven weeks in Europe, your, your creative uh, output is very high. You know, your technical output, your technical prowess is very high. So, uh, you know, it's uh, been a challenge of mine to get uh, the band at such a high level on, on uh, record. You know, we had just finished a very uh, tedious six-week European tour. We had only one and a half days to prepare for the state, and I tried to pick uh, material that would, you know, not be too difficult to get into and at the same time have a certain intellectual uh, capacity. That one of the things about this date is that we didn't expect so many people. I saw I played here in the Jazz Messengers. They came by after and many, many other musicians. And so it turned out to be more or less a jazz party. Well, this particular band is a relatively new band. It's been, I guess, in existence for about a year and a half. And, uh, I've watched this band grow within the past year. We've been virtually uh, all around the world. And uh, Mo Gru Miller, my new pianist, has grown to a very, uh, to being a very brilliant pianist. Steve Turi, I think, will be one of the future innovators on the trombone. Uh, my young drummer, Tony Reedus, I've watched him grow in the past year into a very uh, phenomenal creative drummer. Stafford James, I, I think, is one of the major voices of uh, the bass today, the contra bass and its innovations. I resided in San Francisco uh, from 1972 to uh, the latter part of 1974, you know, solely to play with Bobby Hutchison. We were contemporaries in the Eric Dolphy Quintet in 1963. Bobby is uh, one of my very dear uh, friends and also one of my uh, very big influences. We discovered on our recent tour of Japan in uh, November of 1981 that we had a very unique sound with a trumpet, uh, fiber harp and trombone. I think people become more aware of the uh, art form of jazz, the art of improvising. I feel very optimistic about the future of jazz.